in, in terms of you know his face when you're first there or, or even the rest of him what is it that you saw that made you concerned about his medical needs um i was really concerned about i thought his face looked puffy and swollen um which would happen if you are putting a grown man's weight on someone's neck um i I noticed some fluid coming from what looked like George Floyd's body um, and in a lot of cases we see a patient uh, release their bladder um, when they die. What's the point of doing chest compressions? Um, pumping, pumping the blood for somebody that's not doing that themselves, um, trying to get a pulse back. And were you able to do that? any of those steps? No, sir. Why weren't you able to do any of that? Because the officers didn't let me in to the scene. I also offered, in my memory, I offered to walk, kind of walk them through it or, or told them, if he doesn't have a pulse, you need to start compressions. And that wasn't done either. And when you couldn't do that, how did that make you feel? Totally distressed. Were you frustrated? Yes. Ms. Hansen, you know, I, as I told you, we can take our time, so feel free to just take a minute. And how were you doing that, trying to get the officers to focus on you and get help? Uh, I think, I've, in my memory, I tried different tactics of um, calm and reasoning um, and tried to be assertive. Um, I, I pled and was desperate. Some, some people were um, swearing. Yeah, absolutely. And would you describe other people's demeanors as upset or angry? Um, it's, it's, I, I don't know if you've seen anybody be killed, but it's upsetting. The answer is yes, I was just going to object, Your Honor. As argumentative, and you can proceed. I'm going to just ask you to answer my questions as I ask them to you, okay? Did you describe Mr. Floyd as a small, slim man? Overruled. Yeah, it appeared to, uh, with three grown men on top of somebody, it appeared that he was small and frail. Okay. But I know that's not I'm, to be there's true, no obviously. Question. There's no question. I was finishing my answer. Uh, members of the jury, we're going to take the name. Please uh, go back into the courtroom. Counsel, remain. You will not argue with the court. You will not argue with counsel. Mm -hmm. They have the right to ask questions. Your job is to answer them. I was finishing my answer. I will determine when your answer is done. Okay, well... And so, do not argue with the court, do not argue with counsel, answer the questions, do not volunteer information that is not requested. 